hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope everyone is having a great christmas um hope everyone is surrounded by family and friends and i hope everyone got everything they want so today is going to be a really quick video for you guys i am going to be showing you something that santa brought to me early which is in this box here is an item from louis vuitton i actually went in the store on Sunday to order it and it just arrived today. So that is like insane shipping. Actually, the lady told me that it wouldn't be here before Christmas. So I'm so shocked that it arrived and I'm excited to open it. So I thought I would film the true unboxing for you guys just to show, you know, show you my first impressions of it and kind of, I guess what I think about it in person, even though I got a chance to look at it and try it on in person, but the one that they had there, <laughs> I think it had a scratch on it and I wasn't trying to take that chance of going home with it. It was a display model and I wasn't going to take that chance of going home with it and then like regretting it because I just couldn't get past a, like a little, it was a little tiny scratch but I, I didn't want to take that chance for the amount of money I spent on it. So yeah, without further ado, let's get into this unboxing. So. Yep, that's what it looks like. And then just look at the box. Got some Louis Vuitton on the inside. Here is the box. And pull it out really quick for you guys. So let's take this ribbon off. And here is the box. Like I said, pretty small box. So you know it's not a big item. Let's open the box. Got the Louis Vuitton. And then I'm gonna give you like five seconds to guess what it is. Okay, did you guess? <laughs> so, let me take this out. Put the box down here. This is something I've been eyeing for a while and I feel like it fits my aesthetic and like how I've been transitioning my wardrobe into more like of a let me stop talking and, and show you the bag first. Okay, so it is the Louis Vuitton bum bag in the black, and I don't even know what this um, is. What is this called? It's something with an EM. Pause, hold on, let me say. Okay. Got it, okay. So this is the Louis Vuitton Imprinté. This is French, so I don't know. Imprinté bum bag in the color black. Um, it comes in the color cream as well, but I love black. So I got it in the black, and I absolutely love this bag. I'm so happy I got it. I love the embossing of the um, Louis Vuitton little, um, initials and all that on here that's like what really attracted me to this bag and just to like this line of bags because i saw they have an alma bb bag like this and i i love it but i also i already have an alma bb in the monogram so that would be kind of stupid to get it in black but i love the like the embossing of the black in these i think that is so cool it has the top handle just like the regular bum bag the monogram print it is smaller than that bum bag which i really love because when i seen that um other bag in the louis vuitton store that is a huge just like a book bag i wouldn't call it a bum bag so this size is absolutely perfect on me and i'll try it on at the end of the video so you guys can see like what it looks like on but it does come, like I said, with the top handle, and then the back of it has this little zip, which I'm definitely gonna be putting like a card case or something in there, just so you know that's extra security. And then you're gonna get a little peek of the inside of it, which is this orange, what kind of material is this? I'm not sure what material this is. It's not the same material that's in all the other Louis Vuitton bags though, but, it's like this really, what's the, the same orange of the Louis Vuitton box that the boxes come in, or that the bags come in. So it's that orange and like I said, it has the zip on it. 
has a Louis Vuitton symbol and let me see the oh yeah the little tag for the serial numbers is inside the back part of this and then we're gonna come back around to the front and I'll just show you it has a Louis Vuitton right there and we're gonna open her up I love this black and gold combination I just it looks so rich to me and then inside you have the orange as well have a Louis Vuitton tag and inside oh they put these stuff inside so this is made out of cowhide leather and has man-made interior lining and this is like the little care card i believe yeah little care card and then just showing the material that it's made out of so that was packed inside of the bag it has like a decent amount of space but the older i get the less i bring with me especially like i would consider this more of a shopping bag and I just don't carry a lot of stuff around when I go shopping and all that. So the older I get, the less I need. I did grab a couple things that I usually carry with me. Let me grab mine. So I actually have a Louis Vuitton wallet, which is, this is an older version. I think this is the Alexandra wallet that I got on eBay earlier this year but this is I, I'm honestly too big like I don't I thought I would need a big wallet to hand like handle all my cards and stuff but I only use like the same two cards in here so this definitely isn't fitting so I'll have to downsize from this and I have a couple small like smaller cards I'll probably end up getting like a card holder or something let me see I always keep wet ones so I'm definitely gonna put some wet ones in here so I'll just fit those in there I have my cell phone, so I'm gonna put my cell in there. I have I always keep lotion on me, so bottle of lotion's gonna go in there. My AirPods always keep those. I'll probably throw these in the back. And then I usually keep a charger, put that in there, and then I have a bag for like pads and stuff but I don't always take it. I just take my lip gloss out of there. So that would be there. And then I will put a card case in the back as well so that wouldn't take up much room at all. But that's all fitting in there perfectly. If I were to open it up, I don't think there would be much hassle on getting the stuff in there. So yeah, and I, I mean, honestly, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't take that. <laughs> my phone is usually fully charged when I leave out the house. So that is what it looks like. Not bad at all. This is perfect for what I need, honestly. I'm not sure what this, let me fix my, my Pharrell hat. Good, okay. I'm not sure what this is right here, but I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'll Google to see what people use that for. Of course, the waistband is adjustable, so I'm gonna adjust that to probably wear like this most of the time. But I'll also like, I did try it on around my waist. Let me. I tried it on around and it's actually not bad just because it's not like the big size that the other original one is. So really love that. And yeah, those are a couple of ways. But again, like I said, you'll see in a minute how I will wear this the different ways and of course this is also going to be in my December new end video that I've been doing every month just to show like the items that I got in and this is definitely gonna be featured in there so you'll definitely see how I style this up first impressions of me receiving this bag absolutely love it this is gonna definitely be an everyday bag for me I can already tell like I said earlier it fits my aesthetic of like casual cool but also I guess like edgy and just kind of more like I can dress this up um, as well so like when I do want to be cute I'm probably not gonna get too fancy and this is like something that would kind of like 
tone it down more. But I absolutely love this. I cannot wait to wear this. And yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys a couple shots. guys that concludes the video i really hope that you enjoyed this this is just a quick one just to show you what santa claus blessed me with i'm super excited i'm super happy and i'm also super very blessed this is closing out the end of a new decade and i'm just so happy i'm glad i started my youtube channel you know just styling is something that's more of a passion for me and i just found like an avenue that i could kind of use that um passion to deliver to other people and honestly i just love it so i'm so happy you guys are hanging with me and i'm expecting bigger and better things for um the year 2020 and for the new decade God has been so awesome to me and my family this this year, this decade. I was just talking to my husband about this a couple days ago. Just the transformation from the beginning of this decade to the end is just like, man, you just gotta give it all to him. So um, yeah, I hope you guys are blessed. I hope you guys enjoyed your Christmas and I hope you have a happy new year and I will see you guys next year. And if you are not subscribed yet, please go ahead and click the subscribe button, like this video if you do like this. And I think that's it. See you guys.